Hello everyone, I've told you before how we can benefit from DNZ on as a home users on our gaming uh, consoles for an example as PlayStation. Uh, in order to enable DMZ on our PlayStation as an example, of course as a first step we should set our PlayStation static IP, okay? Uh, we've done that on the previous uh, videos. You can find the link on the description on this video, okay? After we set the static IP, I will show you now how we can enable DMZ on our PlayStation based on a TP-Link modem TDW8960, okay? We open the Internet Explorer. We put 192.168. Dot one dot one. We click enter. We will have this page. It will ask us for username and password. Username we put it as an admin. Password we put it as an admin. We click login. Then we go to advanced setup, and then we go to NAT, and then we go to DMZ host. On the DMZ host IP address, we put the IP that we assigned it to our PlayStation. In my case, in my example, I used this IP address, okay? We put it here, the one that we put it here, when we assigned the IP address for our PlayStation. After you put the IP address, you click save and you are done. I hope you will have a great gaming experience. If you find my video useful for you, uh, I would be thankful if you subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.